predicting, you know, 2021 and looking at what to run because we've got more than ever a lot of options on the table, man. <laughs> I <laughs> great great question, Jim. We <laughs> we're kind of we're kind of wanting to wrap this up here with with with, uh, with the Baja 1000 win and see what happens for next year. But obviously, our our heart is in Baja. We love Baja. We love the people down there. Um, we love pre running. We love we love everything about going to Mexico. And I think what we saw last weekend in San Felipe was the people of Baja love it. It was busy down there. Um, they missed us. We missed them. So we're going to de- definitely do all the Baja races next year. And then as far as any sort of race here in the States, we're, like you said, we've got, we've got quite a menu to pick from. We've got <laughs> Best in Desert. We've got the Legacy Series, which is new. We've got um, the Mint 400 with the Martellis. We've got King of the Hammers with Dave Cole. We've got just a ton of things to think about. And so, um, you know, really, we don't really know what we're going to do here in the States. We, we'd love to do them all, but, um, budget reasons and time, time constraint really doesn't make, doesn't allow us to do that. So our focus next year is certainly all of Baja for the score series. And then, uh, kind of, we'll see how, how the, the end of, the, of this year wraps up and we'll make a decision because there's like five or six races in like a three month period. So yeah. you've got to pick, pick them wisely and, and go with your gut and go. Yeah. How about, uh, I know I, I see uh, you and your dad, he, he loves making the annual trip back to Crandon. I know you guys have a ton of fun. You ever had the itch to get behind a Pro 2 or oh, yeah. something like that at Crandon, Dan? I actually I actually raced a Pro 2 at Crandon in 2013. I it was We were at the Nora Rally in April, and I was with Stephen Bryce Menzies um, having a few uh, quote-unquote sodas, <laughs> and I... I was making a, I'm making a joke and I said, well, I want to go back and, you know, talking talk to Bryce. I said, I want to go back to Crane and watch you race. And Steve goes, watch. No, you got to race. Let me, let me, let me find you a truck. I said, okay, whatever. <laughs> well, a couple, a couple days later, a couple weeks later, I get a phone call from Steve like, Hey, Scott, Scotty Taylor said he would love to rent you his truck, I, you know, for a, for a small fee. I said, well, of course. So long story short, I raced Scotty Taylor's pro two in 2013. And, um, Boy, I have a lot more fun watching, but it is it is so intense. I remember turn one, I was like, okay, hang on, and it was it, it's. I tell you what, I I love my trophy truck after racing Pro Two. It is it, it is certainly something else. Those guys are absolutely insane, and uh, I would love to do it again. I think if I do it again, I do it in a Pro Four because I got a little more experience now in a pro in a trophy truck with a four wheel drive. So. Um, but I, I do love going back there. I love everything about the, about Crandon. But I mean, we went we went last year and it was Kid Rock was there. So I don't know how they're going to top that. But we'll definitely be back next year for it. Um, we might we might race something. I think my dad and I were talking about maybe renting some of those stock trucks and just having fun and going door to door at like you know 40 miles an hour versus 100. So. Um, we're not sure yet, but we'll definitely be back. Yeah, I know uh, Street Bike Tommy was back there, and he's a buddy of mine. And uh, he he showed up, and some guy with a stock truck gave him the truck, and Tommy went out there, and he's like, he had the time of his life. <laughs> and I'm like, I could see almost like a celebrity stock truck division. Just get a bunch of like trophy truck guys and celebrities, I, and everybody go in there and just bang and bump and have fun. That would be awesome. Kind of like this, kind of like the, uh, the All Star Celebrity Softball game they have before, like the Home Run Derby yeah. or whatever. Just like a and they could just do it on like the short track. They could just have yeah. like you know, I don't know, me, Mark, and Luke, and and Andy, and <laughs> I mean, I think Rob and Bryce already raced Pro Two or Pro Four. So you know, you get a bunch of random people, a couple uh, I don't know, celebrities from all walks of life, and go door to door. It'd be fun. Yeah, it'd be a blast, man. But well, I got uh, we're up against a time break, buddy. But uh, it was great catching up, man. Congratulations again on the uh, win down there in Baja. We'll definitely be uh, pulling for you in uh, in a couple of months at the Baja One Thousand. Cool. Hey, thank you, Jim, for having me on. Yeah, we just, I tell you what, it's like almost a dream come true. I still, I still really don't believe it, but, um, you know, all the phone calls and texts I've gotten from, from all, pretty much everyone, um, uh, makes it seem real. And so we're excited for the Bob 1000. Um, we're going to take what we learned from this race and, and make it even better at the next one and hopefully wrap up the year with a win like we started.
Well, thanks a lot, Dan. I mean, uh, always fun catching up with you. And, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, McMillan family, uh, what can you say? They've given so much to the sport of off-road and, uh, you know, generations going back to Corky. And then, uh, obviously, uh, you got Mark and his brother Scott. And now you've got, uh, you know, the trio of Dan and Luke and Andy. And, uh, you know, don't don't forget, there, there's, you know, Jessica McMillan. I mean, McMillan family, it, it runs deep. It runs deep, and you got to think at some point, you know, you know, Dan's, you know, future kids and Luke's future kids, and obviously Andy's kids, uh, you know, they're going to be the next generation of stars of off road as well. And you know, they've done so much not only for Score but the Off Road Motorsports Hall of Fame. I encourage you if you haven't um, pick it up. I think Race Desert, I think uh, Dirt Co's got it. Uh, you can get the McMillan book, the McMillan family book, and uh, it, Marty Fioka wrote. It's a phenomenal thing. It's basically a piece of off road history. It's, you know, it's dedicated to the family, but there's so much more than that. And and uh, it, it tells the stories of off-road and, you know, from a time that, uh, you know, wasn't really well documented, but the McMillan archives are phenomenal. And it's really, I mean, it's a coffee table book. The thing's thick. I mean, it's a couple inches thick, hardcover, beautiful photos. It is absolutely worth owning. If you're not only an off-road fan but a motorsports fan, check it out. Buy it because i got to tell you, it's probably going to be, uh, you know, something that you look at quite frequently. I mean, I, I flip through it. It's on my desk at the office. And, uh, you know, i got to tell you, there's always something new I find in that book or photo that I missed. And it's not just, like I said before, all about the McMillans, just off-road in general, a lot of off-road history. And it's a great, great piece of uh, nostalgia and history, and everybody should own uh, own a copy of that book. And I'm fortunate to, to have one. I know my dad's got one. Mark gave us both, sent us some and signed them, and just a, a phenomenal read. And, from, you know, just really, if you don't even read it, just flip through and look at all the pictures. Insane. Really, really good stuff. So, uh, yeah, that being said, um, you know, we are uh, – we're going to take a short commercial break here, and uh, we come back. I guess we got closing thoughts, and uh, we're going to close up the show. Uh, it's been a great one, man. This is uh, this one for the books. Uh, Matt Martelli, Dan McMillan, Ed Carpenter, Kelly Crandall, a whole lot packed into two hours, and i got to tell you, I had a whole heck of a lot of fun hosting it. So we're going to t- uh, take a short commercial break. We'll be back here to wrap things up right here on the General Tire Down and Dirty Radio Show, powered by Polaris Razor. Extreme performance, reliability, and the most fun you can have on four wheels? The Polaris Razor brings it to you. But you don't need to take my word for it. You can take theirs. I'm Tanner Faust, and I choose the Polaris Razor because it's the most fun you can have with a steering wheel. What's up? I'm Ronnie Renner, and I choose Polaris Razor because it's the sickest, most reliable side-by-side on the planet. What's up, everybody? Heavy D from Diesel Brothers. Listen, I'm on Team Razor because it's hands down the best piece of machinery on the planet. I'm RJ Anderson, and I choose Polaris Razor because it's the most fun, most capable machine. Action sports stars, TV personalities, and some of the best race car drivers in the world all choose Polaris Razor because it's the ultimate combination of power, suspension, agility, and fun. Find out more information on the web at PolarisRazor.com or follow at Polaris Razor on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and use the hashtag RazorLife to share your story. Thanks for tuning in to the Down and Dirty Radio Show, available live online, in syndication on networks across the U.S., and available internationally on the American Forces Network. Welcome back here to the General Tire Down and Dirty Radio Show, powered by Polaris Razor. Here wrapping things up with a banger of a show. Big thanks to all our guests, Kelly, Ed, Dan, Matt, for uh, for coming on the show. Uh, man, it uh, definitely was a fun one to host. I love shows like this where you get uh, such a, a, an eclectic mix of uh, athletes from and personalities from so many different disciplines of motorsports and allow us to go in so many different directions and chat. But, uh, yeah, UTV World Championship coming up this next weekend. Tune into the live stream. I will be holding it down on Saturday along with Mia Chapman. And, uh, you know, it's going to be Friday as well when I'm racing, so you can tune in, watch the fun. It's going to be a lot of fun out there in Lake Havasu, so really looking forward to that. Uh, we will have a show next week. Uh, we're just going to slide it in and fit it in when we can. May, it might end up being a podcast on Podcast One or something like that. But uh, big thanks to all our supporters, General Tire, Polaris Razor, Vision Wheel, Rigid Industries, Dirtfish, GSPX TV, Oxels, Optimus Starters, uh, iRacing, everybody that continues to support us. Man, we couldn't do it without you. Don't forget get general tire they got that promotion going on for uh the hundred dollar visa prepaid card when you buy four general tires we got a uh, promotion going on on social media with gspx tv axles we're giving away a free set of axles Dirtfish, yeah you want to discount at Dirtfish? everybody does they want to go up there and get some classes at jim beaver 15 or excuse me it's just jim beaver 15 that will get you a 15 percent discount on all your classes and then additionally um you know uh we've got uh, a great promotion going with iRacing pr dash jim beaver and that's going to get you a 50 50% off when you sign up for iRacing. 
And, uh, man, it's uh, good stuff. BetOnline.ag, use the coupon code PODCAST1. You want to bet on some sports? Yeah, that one's going to get you a discount as well. So let me tell you, we got a lot of, a lot of good stuff, a lot of great partners supporting the show and couldn't do it without them. Uh, I am at Jim Beaver 15 on social media. If you want to give me a follow, don't forget, go over to Apple Podcasts, smash the subscribe button. Let them know you like us by leaving a rating as well. If you want to leave a review, it even helps out even more. So lots of good stuff to come here on the show. Like I said, UTV World Championship this weekend. I know been hit up by a few people. No, we won't be on site doing a live radio show uh you know due to COVID-19 and a bunch of other things going on but uh yeah I can promise you uh we are going to get back to doing live remote shows next year my promise is it will happen I know I miss it as much as you guys do and I can't wait to get back on site with uh, Tiffany Stone and everybody else and you know locking it down and holding it down um you know I know we're gonna have her back and uh you know Chris the owner of Power Rankings coming soon so uh, we're gonna get back to a normal uh schedule here on the show but uh man it's been crazy but uh you guys have a great week and see you next time on the General Tired on a Dirty Radio Show, powered by Polaris Razor. You've worked so hard for all the things you have. The salary, the status, the success. And with that image, there's a drink. One to unwind, one to loosen up, one to take the edge off. But how do you know when a drink is more than just a drink? We get it. We can help. Karen's Grandview program has been helping accomplished people just like you regain their lives. Talk to us. Visit karen.org slash grandview. Rule the day the plant-based way with the new vegan mixed berry from Smoothie King. Powered by whole, non-GMO fruits, oat milk, and vegan protein, it's a dairy-free, plant-based smoothie you can feel great about. With 13 grams of protein and half your daily fiber, it's an easy way to get the essential nutrients your body craves. Skip the line and order online for pickup or delivery. Smoothie King, rule the day. Rule the day the plant-based way with the new vegan mixed berry from Smoothie King. Powered by whole, non-GMO fruits, oat milk, and vegan protein, it's a dairy-free, plant-based smoothie you can feel great about. With 13 grams of protein and half your daily fiber, it's an easy way to get the essential nutrients your body craves. Skip the line and order online for pickup or delivery. Smoothie King, rule the day. When you're a pro, you got to do a little bit of everything. A little... A little. And even a little. And it helps to have something that works as hard as you do. That's why Valspar has a paint for every job, every room, every time. Valspar. You make it happen, we make it possible. Pros, head to Lowe's today and talk to a pro rep about getting up to 10 free gallons of Valspar through our paint trial program. Exclusions apply. See ValsparPro.com for details.